Dean, a big match at the bottom of the table, 3 1 win. You must be a happy man. Yeah, of course. Look, going into today, we knew the importance, um, especially with us and the poor round being, being beside each other on the table. So, um, so to come and get the win um, is a great boost for us going forward. Uh, so that puts you now 8 clear of Portadown, 14 clear of Warren Point. Is that Dungannon clear of a, a relegation battle now? I thought it was 9 ahead of Portadown. Um, but, but anyway, look, it's, 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 it's just about momentum and, and now we have that. Um, again, that's four wins in a row, which, which builds confidence and, and belief into what we're trying to do here. And, and the lads are starting to feel it. And I, I see a lot of hungry players. I said it last week. And, you can see the desires there, and and it was another great performance. It is nine ahead of put down. You're right. That's my uh, my answer. So at one point, you could make all the difference. Absolutely, absolutely. So Darren McBrien, seventh league goal of the season, played in by Oshin Smith. Obviously, a lot of talk about those two and interest from the likes of Lintour. Are you expecting to, to hold on to the both of them? No, that's not even an issue. Um, Dara Dar was fantastic today again. Um, he's picked up a knock, which is. Okay which is a little bit frustrating for him, but look, his finish was quality. The goal was superb. It was a great link-up play between the two, and the pass from Oshim was, 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 was superb as well. And, and look, we're getting um, good performance from all the players. We, we've got a lot of good players here that I'm sure a lot of teams would want, but none of them are leaving. Um, again, it's, I'm, I'm starting to get annoyed at the same questions every week, is which players are doing well and which players are leaving, and we're keeping the players, and, that, and that's it. So... Another one of the players that maybe doesn't get as much attention as the others, uh, me hold Lynn, um, a full back. He's on loan from, from Derry City at the minute, but he was, he was absolutely superb out there. Probably a lot of people don't know an awful lot about him, but he, he looked a, a, one of many uh, great, great prospects here. Yeah, no, I think this is one of Miho's best games for us. Um, again, he's a, he's a talented footballer. Um, we, we, we worked hard to get him in in the summer, and he, he's, he's learning. He's another one in that age bracket of 19, 20 that, that we have so many of. and. And he's learning and developing, and you can see the progress is coming with him and his attitude and training. And he's 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 now got that desire to, to defend and won his one v one battles. And and I think those battles one v one across the park today was key. Yeah. So Tuesday night then, Glenavon away. If you manage to get a win there, you'd only be one point behind Glenavon. You must be be looking up the table at this stage rather than what's behind you. Yeah, I think no matter where you are on the table, you want to catch the team that's above you. Um, that has to be an ambition whether you're second or, or, or whether you're last you have to try and catch the team above you and, and that's the progress that, that we want to make um, we'll always try and improve and we'll always try and look to, look who's above us and, and, and look, look at that progression and, and use that as motivation um, Glen Avon's our next opponent so they're, they're the team above us so that would be a big one yeah Great. another good win today congratulations cheers thanks a lot thank you